So, the Scientology Police Department here, it's not the Stockton Police Department, it's the Scientology Police Department that enforces Scientological laws and Dianetics is bringing the city and the county, as well as the world peace, to arresting all of those who disagree. That we live forever, eternally, and immortally in spirit. Inside of the mental health courtrooms. It's where science fiction and professional opinions reign supreme and predominant. Where the evidence of opinion presides. And now, your human qualities and civil liberties, as I have said, these, these are possessed. Don't be afraid, Americans, what we are looking for and what we will accomplish in the state of California as our highest operating Thetan, will become the President of the United States. And we will build the largest holy temple ever known to humanity. Where more Americans than ever before will be instated and instituted. To be enchanted by chemicals and be treated to receive their civil liberties and human qualities. Some of them might turn into robotic like creatures to treat their emotions. And the women, they will all have bipolarity to treat their monthly emotional disturbances from. Demonstration and ovulation. These chemicals, we have done numerous tests on human beings, and we have infused them with the hormones necessary to control emotions. You will involuntarily take a hormone. Some of you will lose your emotions because you have a too many. And we will turn you into robots. Others, you think you deserve full civil liberties and human qualities. And you will suffer the same fate as Mr. Goodpasture. You will imbue us with immortality and eternal life as a civilian sacrifice. For each one of you that is injected with our holy enchanted chemicals, two of our thetans and officers, two church members of Scientology, will be granted immortality and eternal life in spirit. These are the commands and wishes of Xanax the alien who gave us souls through a volcano given to us by the holy prophet of science fiction, L. Ron Hubbard. Some of you will receive behavioral diseases like privacy disorders, antisocial disease. Others, you're a little too right about things and you'll receive a perfectionist diseases. And others will have the new variety of physical appearance schizophrenia. And you will be treated with plastic surgery and Respiradol. And you will become exactly as we want you to appear. We'll turn some of you gray, some of you green, some of you pink. <laughs> to our liking, of course, because we all share several liberties. You see, there is no conflict. Mine are yours, and yours are mine. <sighs> There's no conflict. 
others will be treated for uh, being too delusional, having a detachment from reality. And we will always achieve the happy medium, a in-between perfectionist disease and schizophrenia. Don't be too right about everything. We don't want uh, geniuses in our society. And we don't want people to be so stupid that they can't understand anything. Uh, we want you right in between. Yes. Yes. Yes, our operating thetans can feel it now. We have them ready, they're waiting. They're gonna be a part of the new government. We will rule your country from the state of California. <laughs> Governor Newsom and I. Mark Zuckerberg. We have established a Scientological practice without violating law, no. Because Dianetics and mental health therapy and treatment has nothing to do, nor any correlation with the time period of Scientology and Dianetics. No, not at all. And psychiatrists and psychologists and mental health judges, well, they don't have any connections to hospitals, and nor Scientology. They're not Scientologists. It's not like they would have a... Uh, Conflict of interest that would cause them to accuse, recuse themselves. No, we don't have family members that work in these hospitals. This isn't an organized network. We're a group of people operating freely, and you just happen to fall under our legislation. You don't even have to commit a crime. But when we decide it is time for you to grant some of us with immortality or eternal life, we will arrest you. However, if you don't obey, you will receive criminal charges of resisting. Be civil, please. Take our medicine and receive your human qualities. Now don't be afraid, Americans. Have no fear, Californians. Your civil liberties and human qualities just operate under a different lexicon in the mental health field. Your behavior, just diseases, disorders, and symptoms. Receiving your civil liberties just comes with therapy and treatment. You have all of them. We just call them a, a different name. It's redundancy. This is the future. It is now. The future is here. Through David Goodpasture, you will all become Scientologists. But it wasn't before the state of California, the United States government, and it's welfare code could justify and validate maybe with who and other mental and physical health advocates and organizations that we may shut down entire territories in your whole country when there's a scare. And if you disobey, we'll put you in our holiest temple. Or one of our detainment temples. Where our Scientological Police Department officers regulate all behavior. 